Motion UI 10.1 has been released for the MatePad Pro and this is the changelog and I want to show you what is new. First of all, MeTime screen sharing is now possible. You know, MeTime is the chat application. I cannot show you this while recording the screen, but uh, believe me, it is working now. You have the option to share your MatePad Pro screen with other chat partners. Multi-device browsing is now possible, so you have now the option to search different devices. I can show you this by going into the gallery and you can see here I have other devices here and I can access my Mate 30 Pro without any issues and I can go in to some pictures if I want to and uh, can just simply open up those pictures here. As you can see here it works. Next thing is the multi-device um, control panel you can now by swiping up from the corners and now it searches for devices to share the current screen with and i did not get this to work with any of my devices right now maybe i need a special tv or something like this for it to work then the next thing is apps it has a new integration. I cannot show you this. It integrates dual uh, connection Wi-Fi technology to wi wireless LAN routers from Huawei, as you can see here. And uh, there's a new ebook mode, which is pretty nice because it changes the colorful display into basically a less colorful display, less training for your eyes display. Good to read ebooks or search stuff on websites. And let me show you this. Let's go to a website here. Movie Pilot in this case. I want to inform myself about movies. What to watch. I can go into ebook mode. If you don't get it here, just hit the edit tab and you will find it down here somewhere and you can just drag it here to the top so you are able to use it. I go into ebook mode and now you can see that colors are basically gone on this web page and I have more contrast and it's getting a bit yellowish here the whites are not white anymore so it's easy to read an easy mode for reading so this is basically everything there has also been some updates for telephone numbers when it comes to support but this is basically the main update of emotion ui 10.1 for the matepad pro of course all the goodies like the option for having the multi-window support is still here it's not working with firefox as you can see but in general it works at least here i can open up a new tab like this also i think they improved the desktop mode that had issues in the past with several applications running in windows this has been fixed as well from what i can see and tell and also fluid animations you can see that the animations here for um, destroying applications or closing applications are revamped now as you can see and yeah this is basically the big update Emotion UI 10.10135 it is available for my Chinese version of the MatePad Pro for the European versions uh, it will come out later I think and yeah this is everything for this little video hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching until next time bye